Hey makers this is Ruvin and today let's talk about one power of x expression with function so first of all let me explain you what's the purpose of with function the with function is a way for you to simplify your formula it is reducing the calls for the data sources and increase the app's performance it is basically evolute the argument you gave it then retain the values returned as a record so that you can reference them again within that formula There are so many ways where you can use the with function but let me talk about one of the easiest technique to understand the with function so let's say for an example here i have one power fx expression where i am just passing my user email address to get the user profile of the current user and whatever i am doing here is i am printing his name his surname and his country information and over here you can see that i have used a function office 365 user dot user profile and inside that i am providing user dot email so over here you can see that i have repeated this code three times in one formula now what happen here is every time when we use this kind of expression it is calling my office 365 user connector and based on that database call it is printing appropriate value so i don't need something like this i just want to simplify this i want to simplify my formula so for that i can simply use with function and to use the with function it's a very simple here we will talk about one of the easiest technique so let's just use with inside the with the first argument is scope that is defined by the curly braces which means that the scope of this formula inside the with function only so let's say for an example over here what i will do is i will show the entire user profile so i am just copying this common formula over here like variable user profile let's just create that variable variable user profile in the with function and let's provide this formula so we store this thing over here and after that just provide comma and then what we will use is we will simply use the variable that we created and just replace this entire function with that variable dot given name that variable dot surname and that variable dot country right so what happen here is my expression is not evaluating every time it just a matter that first time it initialize this stuff and then i'm just using that context inside my formula there are many other use cases of with function similar way let's say for an example if you have edit form and if you are printing edit forms property everywhere you can simply store that inside your with function and just perform appropriate thing over there and use it also within the for all loop as well you can use the with function so instead of having this record you can simply add that record inside your with function and with function will return you one record and using that with functions value you can simply add that so that's it for with function i will talk about another use cases of with function in the upcoming video till then have a great day goodbye If you are for the first time to my channel make sure you hit subscribe and press the bell notification to never miss any updates from me. If you are looking for any training or consultation the website link is available over here and don't forget to follow me on my Twitter and Instagram. With this this is Dravin signing off see you in the next session with some amazing content till then have a great day goodbye.